Good evening. As you can tell, last year's homecoming queen is up here with us, Shane Valdez. Thank you. The first homecoming candidate is Shelby Brockman, daughter of Mike and Charlotte Brockman. Shelby is a senior from Beloit, Kansas, majoring in biology. Shelby participated in volleyball for the past three years. Last year, she held the role of team captain. She also was an active member of your ministry, student activities board, and the ambassador program. Shelby enjoys enhancing her academic involvement by participating in Tri Beta Biological Honor Society and the Biochem Club. After graduation, Shelby hopes to attend Wichita State University for the Physician Assistant Program. Upon completion of school, Shelby would like to go back to rural Kansas to practice where she hopes to find herself a good farm boy, get married, and raise a family. Escorting Shelby tonight is Jason, Jason, Jason Mihalson, son of Michael and Janet Mihalson. Jason is a math, physics, and chemistry major from Arvada, Colorado. Jason is an active member of the Von Neumann Society and Biochem Club. You can also find Jason on the basketball court. Jason plans to graduate and start flying as a commercial airline pilot. Our next candidate is Courtney Decker, daughter of Scott and Lisa Decker from Washington, Kansas. Courtney spends the majority of her time putting in hours for her major athletic training. She has been an athlete of the volleyball team and a member of Gold Key and tri -Beta. Courtney has also served as an orientation leader since she has been at Bethany. After graduating from Bethany, she dreamed, her dream is to attend physical therapy school at either Wichita State or Nebraska. After three long years of graduate school, she will immediately buy her dream car from a black Cadillac CTS, no matter how illogical that may sound. Then Courtney wants to move back to the Washington area where she plans on getting married, having four non-redheaded kids, and building a big, beautiful house in the country. Once Courtney's kids are grown and move out, she goes to journey with many crop tours and enjoy the gorgeous Kansas scenery with her great friends. Escorting Courtney is Alex Fambro, son of Cecil and Paula Fambro. Alex is a health and physical ed major from Tyler, Texas. Alex was a baseball pitcher his freshman year and a football kicker for the past three years. Alex is currently in the process of pursuing a professional career in football as a kicker. He is gathering dates together and planning trips to several tryouts at the arena football and Canadian football levels. His ultimate goal is to make it to the NFL. With Alex, while his hopes make it to the NFL, he plans on pursuing a pro player salary to start a scholarship fund and or a charity. The charity would specifically give money to potential missionaries who lack the funds or those who have the desire to share the Bible and Jesus with the world. Regardless, Alex hopes to have a family that he can support and be a consistent example of in Christian man, father, husband, and overall human being. Samantha Anderson, daughter of Gail and Julie Anderson, was born in Waterville, Kansas. She is currently majoring in mathematics and accounting and extremely involved in Bethany College extracurricular life. Samantha is currently a member of Business Club and Von Neumann Society and SGA Vice President of Finance. She also served as the Sweet Suites representative for SGA last year and volleyball athlete for three years, one in which she was captain. First, Samantha hopes to graduate, then get a job in accounting and make a lot of money. She hopes to someday have a family of her own so her friends can finally quit joking that she will be the lonely 50-year-old cat lady, which unfortunately in their favor is a collection she has already started. Samantha hopes to settle down close enough to her hometown so she won't miss out on seeing the family she already has. She already has. She sincerely also plans on staying in touch with all of her wonderful friends she has made here at Bethany. Joseph Hale Jetrohenseski is escorting Samantha tonight. Joe is the son of Kelly and Mark Koshay and Connie and David Jetrohenseski from Longmont, Colorado. 
He is majoring in Christian ministry, youth and family ministry, and communications with a minor in psychology. Along with his immense academic load, Joe is involved with Pi Sigma Chi fraternity and campus ministry. He is also a Bethany ambassador. He goes to BBT with Colin Carlson and loves hanging out and skiing with some of the coolest boys on campus. Joe plans on possibly going to seminary to become a Lutheran pastor. He also wants to get married, have kids, and maybe go on a sailing trip around the world to be an adventurous and spread God's word. And he's also known as one of Wade's and Thomas's babysitters. <laughs> Our next female candidate, another regular babysitter for Thomas and Quaid, Marcy Herb, daughter of Dwight and Laura Herb, is from Mount Ridge, Kansas. She is majoring in biology with a minor in psychology. She is an active member of Sweet Government Association, Campus Ministry, and Bethany Symphonic Band. She also serves as a Bethany Student Ambassador and Tri Beta National Biological Honor Society Vice President. Marcy, Marcy would like to start a career in the alternative energy industry, which would require a lot of traveling. She wants to experience the diversity in cultures and education that the world has to offer, as well as cultivate new positive relationships which might lead to future service opportunities. After a few years in alternative energy, Marcy would like to settle down in the States and either continue her education and career in energies or return to the medical field and become a child psychiatrist. Escorting Marcy tonight is Tyler Gordon. Tyler's the son of Stephen and Jerry Gordon and Sandra and DJ Salisbury. Tyler's a biology and pre-physical therapy major from Santa Maria, California. Tyler's a member of Bethany College football team and Alpha Sigma Nu. After graduating, Tyler plans on going to graduate school for physical therapy. Shelby Brown, daughter of Greg and Michael Brown, is our next female candidate from Taylor, Nebraska. She is majoring in elementary education and is an amazing Lorero for the volleyball team. Shelby is also an active participant in Alpha Theta Chi and the green team. Shelby's future plans include graduating and getting her teaching license. She would like to move to a small rural area and start her teaching career back in Nebraska. Along with teaching, Shelby would also like to coach volleyball or basketball. Timothy John Green is escorting Shelby tonight. Timothy is the son of Phil and Sandy Green from Washington Island, Wisconsin. He's majoring in social science education and he's an active member of BYMT, CMC, and Phi Sigma Chi fraternity. Besides graduating in December, Timothy plans on getting a high school or middle school teaching job for the next year somewhere in Kansas. He also plans on traveling the world with his wife, Emily Green. Alexandria Nicole DeLong is the daughter of Romana and Daryl DeLong from Admire, Kansas. She is an art education major with a concentration in ceramics and painting. Alex is a captain of women's basketball, vice president of Alpha Theta Chi Sorority, and involved with the arts club. After graduation, the first thing Alex plans to do is get a lab of doodle of it. Then she hopes to accept a job teaching ceramics and coaching anywhere that will hire her. Alex states, I'm not too picky about the location of the school as, they, as long as they want me. Before she dives completely into her career, Alex wants to travel more and experience the world for what it's worth. She wants to see the treasures of our humanity and uncover the beauty within it. During all of this, Alex would also like to get married, have a family, and just live a joyful life. Happiness is her ultimate goal. Escorting Alex tonight is Joshua Snyder from Tehachapi, California. Josh is the son of Dave and Suzette Snyder and is a double major in psychology and criminal justice. Josh stays involved as uh, stays involved in cross country, track and field, and law and order club. Shortly after graduating from Bethany College, Josh plans on going and receiving his master's in mediation. After finishing up a master's degree, he hopes to move to Colorado and work his way up to becoming a fourth appointed mediator. Josh would also like to travel and see much of the world as he, as he possibly can and eventually settle down in 
and start a family. Next is Olivia Cherie from Bridges, daughter of Carl and Sarah from Bridges from Waukini, Kansas. Olivia is currently majoring in elementary education, middle level language arts education, and ESL education. Olivia is the Student Activities Board Student Coordinator and SGA representative. She is also a Bethany College Ambassador, a member of Gold Key Honor Society and Peer Ministry. Olivia also spends her time athletically as a participant in the women's tennis team. Upon graduation, Olivia plans on getting a teaching job somewhere in rural Kansas. She will then begin working on a master's degree in speech pathology or school administration. Alongside teaching, Olivia would also like to coach, especially tennis, dance line, and or basketball. Olivia also hopes to continue working with youth and church. Olivia states, someday I want to find myself a special man, get married, build a house in the country, and have many children. If not, I will compensate by adopting lots of mangy cats. Okay, not really. However, on a more serious note, I'm really eager to see what God has in store for me. Escorting Olivia tonight is Colton Grove. <laughs> Colton is the son of Dewey and Lisa Grove from Bell Bellevue, excuse me, Belleville, Kansas. Colton is an elementary education major and played basketball for three years. Colton plans on finding a teaching job around his hometown of Belleville. Along with teaching, he would like to coach. After a couple of years, Colton would like to pursue a master's degree in administration and become a principal. Sarah Peterson is the daughter of Kevin and Rebecca Peterson. She is a senior from Garfield, Kansas, majoring in English with theology and philosophy minors. Sarah holds the position of president of Gold Key and president of Sigma Alpha Iota. She is also the coordinator of Chi Alpha Women's Bible Study. Sarah is an active participant in Kappa Gamma Phi Sorority and Beta Bethany College Choir. Although undecided, Sarah's many possibilities for the future include pursuing careers in writing for the National Park Service, advocating for the low vision community, or applying to graduate school. Accompanying Sarah is Eric John Hall, son of John and Tricia Hall. The local from Lindsborg, Kansas, is majoring in sports management. Eric is currently the head of freshman boys basketball coach and the assistant varsity boys basketball coach at Smoky Valley High School. He also obtains the position of assistant manager for Hibbett Sports in McPherson. After graduating from Bethany College, Eric plans to use his sports management knowledge to work his way into the regional vice president position at Hibbett Sports. Finally, Kelsey Ray Hieronymus is the daughter of Gary and Dee Dee Hieronymus. Kelsey is a psychology major with a business minor from Waukini, Kansas. Kelsey is currently the captain of the Bethany College dance team and the psychology club vice president. Kelsey's future plans are to work in the photography industry as a computer editor or as a graphic designer. Her ultimate dream job would be to own her own event, her own event planning business where she would take care of planning things from small birthday parties to weddings and business events. Kelsey would also like to become a Kansas City Chiefs cheerleader in the very near future. I've always liked working with young children. With my love of dance, I think it would be fun to have a dance studio to teach the basics of dance to young children. Kelsey states enthusiastically. She would like to travel to Germany someday and visit where her ancestors are from. A trip to Las Vegas might be in the near future, as she would like to try and find to try her hand at a little gambling. At last, and last, but certainly not least, she would like to settle down with a handsome man, have three children, and live somewhere warm. Escorting Kelsey tonight is Jeffrey Childs Jr. and Ira D. Autry Jr. Jeffrey Childs Jr. is the son of Jeff and Sherry Childs from Junction City, Kansas. Jeff is majoring in criminal justice with a minor in psychology. Jeff is currently a resident advisor and Bethany ambassador. He also spends his time playing on the Bethany College football team. After
After graduation, Jeff plans on finding a job in law enforcement or entering the military. Ira D. Autry Jr., also known as King Ira, is watched from above by his beautiful angel and mother, Catherine Brownlow. Ira Jr., son of Ira Sr., is from the third ward in Houston, Texas. Ira is majoring in pre-engineering and business management. He is involved in Bethany Athletics as he participates in track and field. He also currently works with Bethany as a ground, ground maintenance. Ira's future plan is to live up to God's, grandma's, and mother's expectations as they smile down at him from above. Later in life, Ira will be providing for his wonderful children and doing what is right to continue his success. He will strive to be the best and believe all things possible. Lastly, Ira's goal is to sign a contract with the Houston Texans in March. Ira finishes, wish you luck and keep your fingers crossed. Thank you for all your love and support. Unable to be here tonight is Tatame Batty, daughter of Michael and Corey Batty. Tatame is a biology major with a minor in psychology from Bennett, Colorado. Tatame is currently a member of the volleyball team. She also participates in Trimeda, Von Neumann Society, and Biochem Club. Her long-term goals are to become a doctor and eventually be happy, healthy, and have lots of children. your 2012 homecoming court. <laughs> After careful calculations, counting the hanging chad and out so forth, Quade, would you please bring the envelope? Shirt like that? Show everybody that shirt. Look at that shirt. Oh. 